You guys thought we were done with the live interviews today. No, we are not. I have Kelly Prale here with me with the David Trailer Zoo in Emporia. Please tell me what is going on with you guys over there. You guys have tons of updates. Well, I want to start first with the construction on your education area. So tell me what's what's the latest update there today? Um, it's coming along really well and yeah. we're hoping to get in pretty soon. Um, projected maybe for the end of November, hopefully definitely by the end of the year. So oh, we're wow. getting really close. Um, we started construction about a year ago, it was in October. I think they moved out from the old center and uh, started some construction moves at that point. But um, almost a year later, we're almost in the door. That so. is, you know, quite impressive. Only a year or two. <laughs> and, it, you know, kind of what updates can we expect too? Or I should say viewers that are going over to the zoo, what can they expect to be different? Sure, we're going to have, um, the center's going to be beautiful. It's uh, going to have two large classrooms um, inside. We went from one, we went from some small offices up front with a, a classroom in the back to being able to offer two classrooms um, that does open up to be one large meeting space as well. We're gonna have an outside classroom to be able to offer people. So we get to do fun things throughout the year at our, uh, we just did Safari Adventure Days where yeah. over 500 kids over a two day span came to the zoo and uh, we get to teach them uh, things about nature, science, conservation. Um, so those are fun things and we get to give them this better space with that. Yeah. So what I'm hearing facility. from you is it kind of a better opportunity for yeah. providing those educational um, opportunities and, and programs. Yeah. It, I mean, 500 kids is a lot of kids and you yes. need places to, to uh, keep them and to, right. to, you know, occupy them. So that's wonderful. You guys yeah. have that bigger meeting room, you know, those classrooms mm -hmm. that you guys are able to really um, kind of you know, teach them about the yeah. love of animals there, our, right? Our Emporia Friends of the Zoo uh, started a cam campaign back in 2016 and they raised over $4.3 million wow. um, towards that project. It's a mass, there's a whole master plan and this is just phase one um, of that master plan. So there's gonna be things that, that come along in the future as well to um, better for education, that betters for our animals and the, the care that they receive. So it's going to be good. So this is just the tip of the iceberg, yeah. huh? Yeah. Okay, yeah. exciting. And I, it, speaking of other exciting things, you guys have an event coming up here um, mm -hmm. <laughs> for the spooky Halloween season. Do you oh, mind yeah. telling me some about that? Yeah, absolutely. We have a Boo in the Zoo. I know many <laughs> zoos have Boo in the Zoo, but uh, we have our own version down in Emporia and it offers a nice, safe uh, family environment. There's going to be games and activities for the kids. Um, of course, the treats are going to be there. So it starts at four o'clock in the afternoon on Tuesday, the 31st of October. Um, oh, right there on so, Halloween. Yeah, right Wonderful. on Halloween. Okay, easy so, to remember then. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So come in costume. You know, we encourage kids, adults alike. We'll be in there in costume as well. We've got local organizations volunteering their time to hand out candy. Um, it's a big event that we enjoy yeah. doing every year. Um, and then after that, to finish off our year, we're also going to have our happy holidays. Um, and we have a zoo lighting. We put lights. I know different communities have different type of um, lighting opportunities mm -hmm. for the holidays and our zoo does a nice one so uh, we have somebody come flip the switch and there's games and activities again it's a good time to come oh, out as wonderful. well for families so. do you by chance know uh, the date off the top of your head for that the is holidays tuesday november 21st wonderful so, so yeah. people can come out see that light uh, switch be yes. flicked on and uh, have a whole bunch of fun playing games and hopefully see a little bit of the animals too right yeah absolutely absolutely okay. there, it's a nice place to when we're open for boo in the zoo or for the happy holidays it's a nice time to stroll through the zoo oh, yeah. and see what's what's happening with the animals also. It's absolutely beautiful. The lights just, you know, add a little cherry on top to what we already enjoy yes. with those animals for sure. All yeah. right. Well, Kelly, thank you so much for coming and sharing yeah. the exciting new developments at the zoo. We, uh, thank you for having we us. love our animal friends too absolutely. and our human friends. Can I say thank you to our community as well, Emporia. Yes. Um, they're always a very generous community who uh, steps up and helps projects like this come to life. So we really appreciate the support and time that they give us. 100 so, percent. Thank yeah. you, Kelly. I appreciate that. Yeah. Uh, and we appreciate you coming on today. All right. Thank you. Of course.